This is Twit. Leo Laporte, the tech guy. 8888, ask Leo the phone number. On we go with the show to Diane in Chicago. Hello, Diane. Hi, Leo. Please help save me. <laughs> How do I... Honest, this is, this is crucial. How do I share, transfer, move all of my photos from my main Gmail account to another Gmail account and do it on my laptop, not on the phone? So uh, they're both they're in Google Photos, not Gmail. They're in your Google account. Is that right? Correct. Yeah. Which is a G which is a Google Gmail account. Correct. Yeah. Well. Yeah. Gmail's the email program. Most people have a Google account because they got Gmail. So it is associated with that Gmail account, but it's your photos.google.com, just like your contacts are in contacts.google.com. So it really is independent of Gmail. But I understand. I Believe me, that's the that's the way people talk about it. My Gmail account is my Google account. So what would be really nice is if Google had a button that said, transfer all the photos. In, and by the way, you should do this now because, remember, they're going to start charging you for photo storage in, a, in two weeks. Um, tomorrow, isn't it? Is it tomorrow or is it the 15th? Maybe it is tomorrow. The first. Holy cow. Yes. <laughs> now you see the urgency. Now I see the urgency. Um, so there are ways to do this uh, without downloading them all and then uploading them all, which is what you definitely don't want to do. So, uh there is a um, let's see. You, there is a transfer command that will let you transfer it to another account. So I think what you want is cloud transfer. So if you want to transfer all of the storage in one Google account to another, you want the cloud transfer, which is hidden in somewhere. Let's see. Is it in the copy to folder? It might be. Um, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to zoom in a little bit on my on my uh, Google account here to look at it. <laughs> um, oh, maybe this is a third party service. Oh, this is a third party service. Sorry, this is Mult Cloud. Mult Cloud. M U L T C L O U D. That that's probably. Let's see if we can. Google should have a way to do this, shouldn't they? Um. Golly, they maybe they don't want you to do this. How to transfer phone? I'm looking. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. I'll select them all, and then no, don't download and upload. We don't want to do that. You could share the albums. Yeah, Google doesn't give you away. There's the takeout, the Google takeout. There's the. Uh, oh, this is frustrating. Yeah, Google should have a button because it's just on their hard drive, right? It should just be. They wouldn't even have to move the pictures. They would just have to assign it to a different, um, a different uh, thing. So I guess the f if you don't want to use a third-party program, the easiest way to do it would be to share it all, and then to the new the new account, and then download it into the new account. And that would all happen pretty transparently. You wouldn't actually have to download it to your computer at all. Boy, that's frustrating. Google. Leo, Leo, when I tried to do that, it said file failed. Oh. Uh, so you you shared all the all uh, all the pictures to the new account, and then when you went into the new account, and there's your shared stuff from your old account, and when you said download it, it wouldn't let you do it. It said file failed. Hmm. And I didn't want to do it all, just specific ones, like when I'm at Petra in Jordan or when I'm at Easter Island. I mean, photos that I can't get back. Petra's amazing, isn't it? I've never been to Easter Island. Was that amazing? Oh, it was wonderful. Yeah. <laughs> oh. All right. So there is a free, the chat room is saying there's something for free called Cloud Store. Okay. Um, cloud store transfer. transfer. No, that's not it. Let me chat room. Do you have a link to that? Clouds fur. Sorry. C L O U D S F E R. This is, you know what? This is a good thing to know about. I'm glad we, you asked this question. Cloud migration between cloud storage providers. Clouds fur. Terrible name. 
It's like transfer, but instead of tran, it's got the word cloud provided by Zunami with a T, on-prem cloud transfer, and you can try it for free. So maybe the free version would give you enough to do this. I'm only moving 3,000 pictures. Yeah, I bet you could do that in the free. And they support, by the way, not just Google, but everything. So that's kind of cool. You can move it from Flickr to Google and so forth. With Clouds for Migration tool, you could transfer your photos and videos from Google Photos to any cloud storage or backup photos and videos to... F da -da -da. Yeah, it looks like you can do it. So thank you, chat room. Clouds for... <laughs> Terrible name. <laughs> Cloud, C L O U D S F E R, um, and then Google Photos Help has. Uh, okay, so this is what Google says. Is if and this is the share your library, but you already tried that and it didn't work. Um, so let's see. Yeah, that's what Google's recommending in their Google support. I'm currently, I'm trying to move all my uploaded college. You know what this happens to is a lot of people have uh, Google accounts through their school. And then they leave school and, they, and the school says, all right, you got three months to get your data off of here because we're going to just deactivate your account. So share your library with your other email. You can add all the photos to the library of the second account. Archived photos are excluded, but it works for everything else. This is what Google says. Any photos you save from a shared library won't take up storage until you stop sharing the library. Uh, okay. Okay. So I'll put a link in, to this in the show notes as well. So we got a couple of links. But I think Clouds First sounds like the way to do it. Yeah. Uh, wow. Get it done. Get her done. You got, uh, you got uh, a little time. That's it. Midnight. <laughs> I thought it was the 15th. Now I'm going to think about this. Are you, basically, if you're, I'm going to keep my Google account, but you'll want to upload every photo that's not there because those will be free up until the deadline. And then from then on, they start charging. Right. Wow. Yeah, it ends Tuesday. Holy cow. Well, we've got our Memorial Day uh, uh, work set out, cut out for us. <sighs> Thank you, Diane, for asking. That was That's a really important uh, uh, call. I'm glad we could get that in. Everything going well in the Windy City? Oh, it, it's great. Actually, I'm not in Chicago proper. I'm on the outs. I'm in, you know, in one of the suburbs. Okay. But I wanted to ask you... If I would you recommend me buying storage one month until I get this done and then letting the storage go, or would you recommend that I move all of my photos onto my flash drive? Well, the good news is the cur are you getting rid of the old account? No, I'm so going to keep it. So the good news is you can keep those photos there forever and never pay. Because anything you've uploaded now up to June 1st, is free forever. It's only going to start charging for new photos after June 1st. So that account's fine. In fact, what you should do is say, oh, I'm not going to upload anything new to that account, and it will be free forever. It's also free for Pixel phone owners, and, and there are some uh, exceptions, but yeah. And then the backup and thing Android. is takeout.google.com yeah, take will let you uh, download those at any time. In fact, I've done that. You know, if uh, I actually at one point downloaded it. It was a pain because they come down in a weird format, but I downloaded every photo in my Google Photos uh, library just to have a backup of it. But I think Google's reliable. It, the, the only issue is, and it can happen, and I've heard it happen to people. You've heard it on this show. Sometimes Google, uh, for reasons you know known only to them, kills your account. <clears throat> in which case you, you lose access to those photos. So it is probably good to have it somewhere else. Clouds for I'm going to have to take a look at that and give that a try. That sounds like it might be a good solution. Great to talk to you. Thank you for calling, Diane, and reminding us Tuesday's the day. I, For some reason, I thought we had to the 15th. Oh, no.